In tonight's 7 on your side, Fox 7 Austin's Carissa Lemkel has more on a scam that appears to be affecting Central Texans. This ADT security video appears to capture one of its own, a representative stopping by a Round Rock home. He opened the door and he told me he was here to check on my security system and that he needed to get access to my house inside to check the wires. I really need to get in because they told me that I need to do a security check and make sure everything is installed properly. But Paige, who didn't want to disclose her identity, had not made an appointment and was quickly wary. There was no badge and there was no ID on him. And he drove an unmarked car. And then he goes, well, I saw a sign in your yard that said ADT. So that indicated to me he wasn't sent here by them. He was just looking for signs. A sign that Paige has since removed from sight. While we can't confirm in this specific case, a quick search brought up multiple posts on social media about similar interactions. And that's not the only uniform scam. Recently, Austin Energy sent out an alert about people posing as the utility company, going door to door to give you an estimate on solar panels, asking to assess your roof or even come inside. Perhaps it's to scope out your entry points and valuables to come back at a later time. Or ADT says companies will sometimes pose as them to ultimately trick you into switching security providers. According to ADT, here are some common phrases that sales rep scammers may use to gain entry. Quote, we are here to upgrade your ADT system, or I'm with the company that manufactured your alarm system, or ADT is no longer covering your area. For further clarification, an ADT spokesperson tells us most ADT appointments are pre-scheduled and when arriving at a customer location, ADT professionals are required to present identification. They also drive branded vehicles and wear ADT uniforms. If that is not the case, then ADT advises consumers not to engage and to notify local authorities. While our dealers do door knock, they're committed to our code of conduct. They are prohibited from using any language that might confuse the customer or in any way imply they work for ADT or were sent on behalf of ADT for any service issue. I would just say be careful and don't open or answer your door unless you have an appointment. Carissa Lemkel, Fox 7 Austin News.